Behold, some of BMW's finest ever concept cars. BMW's design form has dipped of late. Here are some better flights of fancy. Hello, welcome to Big Show TV's Another Show. Before going into video, please show some love by subscribing our channel. Thank you. Let's get started. 1969 BMW's Pickup Unveiled at the 1969 Geneva Motor Show, this was the brainchild of ill-fated design house Breton. Based on a modified 2000 CS, the pickup features two retractable stainless steel roof panels that stow away into the roll bar. Up front though, it's pure Alfa Montreal and Lamborghini Espada, Marcelo Gandini was the man responsible, and underneath sits a 2.5 liter BMW straight six. The concept car shown at Geneva even came up for sale a few years back, too. BMW E25 Turbo Look familiar? That's because it is. This is the predecessor to the lovely BMW M1, built for the 1972 Summer Olympics in Munich as a rolling test platform for new technologies, including an advanced radar system to warn against curbs and hippies and other hazards of the day. Paul Brack's design language would later find its way onto the M1, 8 Series, and even the Z1, yep, the Zeroxter with those doors. BMW Nazca Concept This is much, much more like it. The BMW Nazca M12 Concept was the design debut of a 26-year-old named Fabrizio Giugiaro, who took his inspiration from Formula One and Group C racers. A fine palette to paint from, if you ask us. The frame and body were carbon fiber, along with light alloy components throughout to keep the curb weight at a very, very lithe 1,100 kilograms. The Nazca's bonnet and boot were made in one piece, and it featured a wraparound windscreen and 360 degree visibility. Oh, it also featured a 300 brake horsepower, 5.0 liter V12 lifted from the 850i here mounted in the middle and matched to a 5-speed manual, powering the rear wheels. Also has gullwing doors, and is therefore excellent. BMW Concept Coupe Mill Melia BMW's Mill Melia Concept Coupe is surely how people from the 1950s imagined the future would look, and it looked good. Clearly taking its shape from that classic 328, this concept utilizes a carbon fiber body wrapped over the chassis of the Z4M Coupe. That's a very merry 3.2 liter straight six producing an even merrier 340 brake horsepower, the same engine you got in an E46 M3 2. BMW Gina Concept The simple stuff first. This concept sits on the Z8 Roadster platform. And there ends the simple stuff. The skin, well, it's a flexible texture that stretches over a metal wire structure reinforced with carbon fiber. The idea was to allow the driver to change the shape of the car on the move. At the time, designer Chris Bangle reckoned this was the future of car design, allowing customers to create their cars around their own requirements. A quick look at the local Halfords car park suggests Mr. Bangle's predictions may have been a little off the mark. Perhaps. Top Gear suspects, because of the potential damage caused by scissor-wielding hooligans. BMW M1 Homage Concept BMW rather likes its history, and with cars like the M1 littered amongst its timeline, why the hell not? This blast of tango emerged at the 2008 Concorso di Eleganza, marking 30 years since the original BMW M1, the company's one and only true supercar, was launched. So this one gets similar proportions, all low, wide 70s arrogance with a flare of modernity thanks to then designer Chris Bangle's flame surfacing. No word on the powertrain, it was just a design exercise, but oh, how we wished for a mighty V12 under the bonnet. Just imagine. BMW Vision Efficient Dynamics The VED arrived in 2009 and instantly became one of the most talked about concepts in recent memory, not least because it was full of layers. And tech, too. 
Underneath sat a turbo hybrid drivetrain that promised M3 levels of performance while emitting less than 100 G slash KM of CO2. That's like eating lots of cake and not getting very fat. Or something. And it's reached reality in the shape of the i8. Even better. BMW Vision Connected Drive. This is BMW's vision of the future, in which cars seamlessly become your brain, though without the painful lobotomy that accompanies such ambition. No, this VCD, unveiled in 2011, is the company's idea of a connected, networked car future. Things like a 3D head-up display, an emotional browser that captures information about the neighborhood you're driving through, and even multicolored fiber optics on the bodywork. BMW 328 Homage Concept Yes. So much yes, it's difficult to know where to start. The 328 Homage Concept is an erm, homage to the classic BMW 328 from the 1930s, one of the company's finest ever racing cars. We also like to think it's a nod to the fine, fine E36 328i Sport. We suspect we might be wrong here, but whatever. Built of carbon fiber reinforced plastic and packing a 3.0 liter straight six, it is a mix of aluminium, leather, power, and nostalgia all wrapped up in a two-seater package. Just, yes. 3.0 CSL homage concept. The original CSL remains a permanent fixture upon BMW's wall of excellence, and with a nickname like Batmobile, you don't need much persuasion to see why. This concept, unveiled at the 2015 Villa d'Est Concours in Italy, is a yellow-hued salute to that fabulous 1970s racer, and it's certainly a thing. There's lots of carbon fiber reinforced plastic, and a design that nods to the original CSL's signature notes, while inflecting BMW's newer design philosophy into a wide-arched package of fury. Box, consider yourself ticked. So that's it for our list A few honorable mentions, if you have the time to google them, must also go to the BMW Hurricane concept of 1964, the BMW 528-502 concept, and the Soul M8 that lurks around BMW's HQ. Well that's all for today's video, hope you enjoyed it, hit the like button, and don't forget to subscribe.